guys. Hello. 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 Oh my god, what just fell down? Yeah, this is not very steady. Neither am I. I have a lot of energy today. I am sorry for what you're about to go through. I hope you're all doing really well on this fantastic Wednesday. It's finally like not 30 degrees in London and I'm very happy because there's no air condition here, so it's really hot. <laughs> I'm not trying to complain about the summer, this is amazing, but like some kind of in the middle thing would be nice. I am actually wearing pajamas for this wonderful location, and that is because this video is Ariel themed, and this was the only piece of clothing that I had that was Ariel, had Ariel on it. So today we are gonna translate Part of Your World from Little Mermaid. I'm doing a series where I translate Norwegian Disney songs, you are annoying, get away to English so that you guys can see how different they are because I think language is super interesting and it's fun to see that, oh, this is the exact same movie, but the songs are different and they mean different things. It's pretty cool. Time to get to the song. So I'm gonna read a part or a sentence or a paragraph or whatever in English first and then I'm gonna translate it to Norwegian. Oh no, I'm gonna read it in Norwegian and then I'm gonna translate it, oh my god. I'm not in a great headspace today. Oh, this keeps falling over. Stop it. If you guys see my bookshelf, like I rearrange it all the time. I just can't make up my mind. This is new. This is gonna be so hard to not sing. Look at the stuff, isn't it neat? Wouldn't you say my collection's complete? In Norwegian, that is Se vi har, er det flott? Liten prinsesse har kongen slott. And that means, look what I have, isn't it great? I'm a little princess in the Ocean King's castle. So the second sentence is like completely different to the English one, but it's at the same time, it still says the same thing, like, oh, I must look like I have everything I need, or everything I want. Wouldn't you think I'm the girl, the girl who has everything? Maybe you think she has everything, everything she can wish for. So this is literally just like they're using different words, but it's it's the same meaning. Look at this trove, treasures untold. How many wonders can one cavern hold? In Norwegian, that's under self that I'm conscious that I made it i live and day I had had. Do I even need the book? Like, I know this freaking song. <laughs> so this part is a bit different because it's like, I keep wondering if maybe there is more to life than what I have right here. Looking around here, you'd think, sure. She's got everything. Du vil nok si en gang til, hvis hun har alt hun vil. And that's like, you'll say it once more, you'll say it again. Sure, she's got everything. So that's like, really good. I've got gadgets and gizmos aplenty. I've got who's it's and what's it's galore. That sounded so strange, just read out loud without singing. Jeg har alt både ditten og datten. Jeg har titusen ting eller fler. I've got everything. Hmm, I don't know how to translate this. I've got everything, both things and thingies. I don't know how to translate that, please try to forgive me. I've got 10,000 things or more. So we're basically just saying I've got shit tons of stuff. You want thingamabobs? I got 20. Sen fin ding siling, den er til hatten. Which is, look, a nice thingamabob. It's for the hat. <laughs> it's so funny. It's just so like, oh, this is how Ariel is just making up like different meanings for the words because she has no idea what they are. Oh, I should have like framed this differently so that you guys could actually see my shirt. And now that I actually made the effort to put on a Disney shirt for this video, But who cares? No big deal. I want more. Are the girls on my saw and skin mad? And that's is it wrong if I still wish for more? And yeah, so we're pretty pretty close here, you know. I want to be where the people are. I want to see, want to see them dancing. Yeah, I'm scared of either them and skin eye. Oh, I would say, I would say them dance. That's literally the same thing. It's like I want to be where the people are, and I want to see, I want to see them dancing. It's literally the same thing, and that's the first time I think we've actually had the, the exact same sentence in these videos. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, but you're not going to. Walking around on those, what do you call them? Oh, feet. Vandrum King Putsu, what are the heads? You, bam. Again, this is about as accurate as, as accurate can be. Wandering around on to, what were they called again? Oh, legs. Legs, legs, what's on the menu? <laughs> Flip in your fins, you don't get too far. Legs are required for jumping, dancing. That was borderline singing. Finns nok med finner till svansing här. Ben må man ha för att löpa och dansa. There are enough fins for swishing here. Legs are required for running and dancing. So, it's pretty close. Strolling along down, uh, what's that word again? Street. Vandra ned över, vad var ordet nå? Allé. Wandering down, what was the word again? Alley. Pretty close, you know. Up where they walk, up where they run, up where they stay all day in the sun. Där uppe finns det visst ett land där man kan gå i sol på en strand. Oh, it's so hard to read. Up there, apparently there is a land or a country. I get, the country isn't really the right word here. Where you can walk in the sun on a beach. That sounded terrible, but I promise it sounds good in Norwegian. <laughs> Wandering free, wish I could be part of that world. Där man är fri, det kunde bli mer än en dröm. Where you are free, it could be more than a dream. What I would give if I could live out of these waters. 
Et eventyr de tanken flyr et drømmerike. A fairy tale. As I've said before, the Norwegian word fairy tale both means fairy tale and adventure. And I don't really know if it would be adventure or fairy tale here because it's technically for in her mind it's a fairy tale because it's like something you know out of her the like her world it could also be adventure because it's literally like going there would be an adventure because it would be a crazy experience right so i actually don't know but i feel like it would be a fairy tale because especially as the how the sentence works a fairy tale that your mind wanders to a dream world or a dream Kingdom sounds terrible, but I promise it's beautiful. What I would pay to spend a day warm on the sand. I'll touch in pris and surgangspris dog po enstram. Everything has a price. A sunny breeze, stay on a beach. You know how sometimes I've said in these videos that like I don't even know, like the sentence doesn't really make sense in Norwegian either. This is literally what the sentence is in Norwegian, like what you've just heard. So that's how much sense it makes. <laughs> Betcha on land, they understand. Bet they don't reprimand their daughters. Där uppe på land har man förstam. Ingen far känner på sin pike. Up on land, people are reasonable. No dad yells at his girl. Bright young women, sick of swimming, ready to stay. There, women without fins stand on their own feet or legs. No, feet. What sounds better there? I don't know. So it's, uh, you know, it's pretty much the same thing. Also, girl power, yes. And ready to know what the people know, asking my questions and get some answers. Okay, Sangrensen mot Ushant Mall, still no special of Finna Svara. To cross a border towards an unknown goal, ask some questions and find out the answers. So we're doing pretty well here. What's a fire and why does it, what's the word, burn? Vad en flamma och vad heter det? Il. What's a flame and what is, is it called? Fire? Once it my turn, wouldn't I love, love to explore that shore up above? Vad skal det til, hva må jeg gi, og hva er prisen for å bli fri? What's required? from me, kind of. What do I have to give and what's the price to be free? So that's like completely different. Out of the sea, wish I could be part of that world. En utopi som kunne bli mer en andrum. That's a really, really nice sentence. It means a utopia that could be more than a dream. This was a good example of how to express the exact same thing, but in very different words. But this definitely isn't the most different one that I've done. I just really wanted to do the Little Mermaid. Ariel is definitely one of the pretty, like one of the prettiest princesses. I mean, they're all pretty, but like, she's just, I like that she's so different. She's just so vibrant. Like I just love her color scheme. But also who doesn't love a mermaid? Come on. All right, so if you made it through that, if you're still here, <laughs> which song do you think expresses Ariel's feelings better? Do you think it's part of your world or more than a dream? I personally think it's more than a dream. Some of the sentences I feel are more poetic in Norwegian, but obviously some of them just don't really make sense as well. All right, so I shall see you guys next Wednesday and keep up the good vibes.